Hello everyone, in this video, I am going to demonstrate you a step-by-step -step process on how to do your basic statistical tests using SPSS. So the step one is making the master chart using Microsoft Excel. Here in sheet one, we will put all the important details in each column. For basic research purpose, we generally take age, sex and two or three outcome measures. Here I am taking two outcome measures, both pre and post test data. Now we need to put the data from our assessment sheet very carefully. A single mistake here can change our whole study result. So we need to be very careful here. Now after inserting all the data, name the sheet 1 as group A or group 1 or experimental group. Make another sheet by clicking on the plus sign and name it as group B or control group. Here also insert all the data carefully. You can copy the headings from sheet 1 by selecting the column and press Ctrl plus C key and paste it in sheet 2 by pressing Ctrl plus V key. Double check the data. Now create another sheet and name it as group A and B where we will put all the data of group A and group B similar to what we made in the previous Excel sheets. Here we will make another column where we will name it as group. We write the respective groups from where we are taking the data. So now we are done with the master chart. Here is a simple data that I have prepared for you. You can see age, sex and the two outcome measure here that is visual analog scale or VAS and OMAC scale respectively. You can see in all of these excel sheets that I have given number 1 and 2 in sex column as it will be easier for us to analyze the data in SPSS. Here 1 means male and 2 means female. Ok, so we are now done with the part 1 of this series. In the next part we will discuss about the process of doing the statistical analysis using SPSS software. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe.